So for Searle, um, if, if I'm doing an assessment, I'll do it once. A lot of times, um, I'll turn this into a mobilization where I'll take the patient through it. Um, it's a pretty intense tensioner, and, and we'll go over tensioners and sliders in a second. But, so if I'm trying to get Searle, I'll put the patient's ankle on my shoulder. I'll dorsiflex and invert. I already feel it. Uh, okay. so, <laughs> and so then, um, if I was trying to kind of mobilize it, I would really just like the end, just oscillate. Okay. Um, but but again, it's, it's where the patient's having symptoms. So if they say, you know, I'm feeling kind of outside of my my calf, check it. Okay. Next one. It's a tibial. So same kind of thing. So now what I'll do to get the E version part, I'll grab kind of behind my head. So I'll dorsal flex and in E vert. And then kind of come up. And then again you can just kind of oscillate. Okay. So there's that one. So if he's doing it without it's kind of a different way. Uh, I feel like I get better control when I'm kind of holding on. Okay. And then the peroneal. So with this one, I'm again using my right hand and I'm just pulling kind of down and in. Thank you.